welcome back to my channel my name's Hope and in my last video I did mostly a video on what I had previously done fixing up my RV and just kind of gave you guys a tour and showed you around for this video I'm gonna be doing um, just some painting and stuff um, in my RV and I'm just gonna film that so if you're interested um, you can keep watching now um, if you have any ideas for future videos for me or if you have any questions just comment down below and let me know so I'm going to be doing also a little bit of decorating and just kind of showing you the decorations I got and the things I want to put up and just some improvements I want to make in the future. And if you have any suggestions, um, I appreciate it if you'd also let me know down in the comments below. So without any further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so for one of the first things I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be painting um, along here. So as you can see, I already did this strip right here, but... Um, all the way along here, they had it in brown, and I was originally going to leave it up because I was going to be doing a butcher block countertop, which, as you know, would be, um, this similar color, and would be, like, very similar in style to that. So, I was kind I was going to leave that up. I'm also probably going to be getting a piece of, like, gray fabric, like, probably a lighter gray to match the countertops, but, um, to go over this, and I'm going to take this out, you know, and put it on, and then get some little covers for those. But, um, yeah, so... I'm going to be painting the whole thing gray, so that's what I've done so far. I think it looks a lot better. I honestly think it really matches with, like, the cabinets and everything, and the guy was really nice, um, the guy who I bought this RV from two years ago. Um, if you want to hear the whole story about that, you can um, watch my last video. Sorry, guys, a little bit of trash and stuff under there, but he gave me, um, he gave me the paint that he used. The, for the walls and the cabinets and everything. So I have that exact paint. He also gave me the flooring, that the extra flooring from this that he used to put this flooring in. And I have more of it so I can put over this. That's what the cabinets used to look like, that color. These pieces I showed in my last video. Um, they go over the sinks for extra countertop space. I have not covered them with this um, wallpaper adhesive stickers yet. So I'm going to do that in the future but yeah that's what it used to look like I think it looks a thousand times better now and these are the curtains I made and that's what the ones that, like, that um he put up but yeah um I made my own curtains I put them up and I really love them so all right um I'm gonna set up the camera and I'm gonna start painting
So I did finish the one up there. I now have to touch it up on the white underneath because I realized I did not have my tape to tape along there. So now I gotta do the white next. I think I'm gonna wait until I get the tape to do the other half of this because I don't know. I just I think that'll make it easier because I don't wanna have to touch up on the whole thing. But how do you think it looks? Like that side versus this side. I think this looks nice. I think this looks better. I'm ha very happy with it. I'm definitely very happy with it. All right. I love it when everything looks so color schemed and everything. All right. I think so for right now, I'm either going to do under there or I'm going to do under here. I think I'll do under here first so that um, I don't need a little brush because... I realized I did not have my little brush that I would usually use to do that. Alright guys, so I was just going to show you guys this. I got a vase. It is cracked. I don't care though because I'm just putting artificial flowers in it. I did just make the crack a little worse accidentally by knocking it over, but um, I can just glue it so that it won't um, crack any farther. But I got this vase for like $3.18 or something at Walmart and I'm just putting artificial flowers in it. I'm going to get some rocks and stuff to put in the bottom of it and then I'm just going to fill it up with some... you know, fake flowers and stuff and, you know, use it to decorate in here. So I have a really pretty one that would go in it. It's really like, um, kind of like that one, but it has like purples and stuff too. So I'm probably going to put that one in the one that I have at my house that I forgot to bring. Probably going to put that in that. So that's what I want to show you guys real quick before I go. So I'm in love with this decoration. Comment down below. Don't you think that's cute? <laughs> like, I just decided to put that up there today. I think that's really cute. I'm gonna have to get some, like, um, what's that stuff? That little, like, um, not clay. You know, the stuff. You stick it down and, and you use it to stick stuff. 
down so it won't fall down. That or I could stick um, Velcro on it and make it stay. But yeah, I think it's really cute. Comment down below what you think. All right, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and turn on the post notifications. And I'll see you in the next video.